Hi all, hope you're all well. Uh, it's a day of first for me today, so uh, it's my first attempt at making a bit of a video log of uh, a fishing match. So uh, apologies for advance if, if it's a bit pants. Uh, you know, with uh, not many people being able to get on the bank, I thought it'd be a nice thing to do just to produce a bit of a video um, and show how we get on for the day. So it's also the first big qualifier since lockdown. Um, not my first match, I've actually got out on Thursday just to give it a bit of a go. It's a bit rusty. Um, and it's also the first time, which uh, apart from being in one of the big major qualifiers, uh, big major finals, I know which peg I'm on before we even get to the bank, which uh, I quite like to be honest. So, uh, so yeah, we're going to Partridge. Uh, like I said, I've been out on Thursday, just have a bit of a, uh, a bit of a go to try and get up to speed. Um, I've drawn peg 42, uh, wind off my back, but there's always a few carp around there, so uh, it's not a bad peg uh, on Kobe 2. Uh, I've caught a lot of stockies and a few carp, and I've ended up with 93 pounds, uh, which, although I didn't win the section or frame, was a, a decent weight for the day. Um, it's sort of hopefully put me in good stead for how it's going to be today, really. Um, so, for, for, by the way, for anybody who's worried about whether they should get back on the bank fishing, uh, I can't speak for everywhere else, but Parkview's done a fantastic job on uh, Thursday. Uh, very safe, you're not getting close to anybody at all. Um, yeah, if, if you're worried about whether you're going to uh, catch the coronavirus or not, uh, it's definitely a hell of a lot safer than going shopping in your local supermarket. So. Yeah, get yourself back out of the bank. Uh, you can't be doing anybody any favours uh, being stuck in the house. So yeah, I'm excited for today. Um, obviously the weather, uh, we've had 12 weeks of glorious sunshine. And um, yeah, you've guessed it, it's windy and raining. So um, yeah, it's not that really. So uh, yeah, I'm going to be on Kobe 5. Peg 113, which uh, to be honest with you, I'm quite happy about. Um, it's normally a good peg on the lake anyway. I think it's. I wanted to draw peg at lakes 2, 5, 6, or Spay. Spay would be a bit hit and miss. Um, so I think, I'm, I think I'm on the right lakes to do well. And I've also got the wind at me. Now I'm hoping that the wind isn't too strong and uh, we're going to be able to present. Um, my bait properly, that's obviously the problem with being in the wind. Um, but yeah, looking at the uh, the map and the way the wind's going, I think it's going to be in my face, so I should be able to present the bait. Um, so yeah, I'm actually uh, I'm really pleased with the peg. I think I've got a chance of uh, doing well today. Um, obviously, uh, I don't know that for certain. I'll probably uh, end up with egg in my face now. But um, no, it should be a good peg. Uh, the only thing I'm not too sure on is uh, Chris Wheeler won the match on Thursday off the point off the end of the spit, which is kind of opposite me, and he's caught he's caught half of his fish on board and half of his fish shallow. Um, but I know uh, having fished Thursday, that not many people caught shallow, so I've got a bit of a quandary whether whether to feed it or not. I think I'm going to have to set the rigs up for it. The target weight is sort of at the top end of what you'll catch by fishing traditionally on the bottom etc so yeah that's the only thing that's going to um, sort of be a bit of a uh, suck it in sea today is to see whether I'm going to have to fish shallow to catch the uh, weight required or, or plug away fishing fishing on the bottom. Uh, I think uh, I'm going to err on the side of I think I'm going to err on the side of fishing pellets, uh, both short, in the edge, and across, uh, just because I think it's going to be a more consistent, safe way to get to the target weight that I need for the day. So I'm thinking hard pellets across, um, micros and expanders or corn in the edge. And there's been quite a few fish caught down the trap this week, from what I can see. Um, yeah, that's been, uh, it looks like paste been uh, the way forward on that so I'm going to fish my favourite sort of pea paste short down the middle as well. Um, had a nice day actually. A bit frustrating. Uh, the wind has sort of not allowed me to fish for the... Um, I felt like I, I had a peg with a lot of decent 
stamp fishing the peg today, so like uh, carp, f ones, etc. They all wanted to be in two and a half foot, three foot across, um, and I've not been able to present the property really. So I've had a few runs of fish across there, but I had to fish like a heavier than I normally would do float and a longer line. And um, the, uh, yeah, I've not been able to keep in touch with the hook bait like I'd like to. So it's been a bit frustrating. I think if I'd have been able to present the uh, the bait a bit better across it was like a, a 150 pound peg um, I've ended up with 122 pound uh, that's been a sort of mixture of fish across I had a few fish shallow and then I've had runs of fish in the edge which sort of got better in the last hour uh, several pellets to the left and I've, I've ended up fishing maggots to the right with an hour to go and that's been quite good but so yeah I've, uh, I've won the lake um, so my initial thoughts were right, it was a good peg on the lake, but um, I've been well off the pace in terms of what's won the match. Um, so it's like it's been the Lake Six show really, so I think uh, Connor Barlow's won the match. Well done to Connor, um, lovely lad, I'm sure we do well in the final. Uh, Kieran Marsden's been second, I think. So I think Connor had 190 pound, Kieran had 169, and Mitch Rawlinson had 150 all off Lake Six, and then uh, Spade Two, Brian McKinley was fourth, and Chris Weeder Jr. fifth with 135, 138 off Kobe uh, Kobe Two peg 35. So it's fished uh, fish really well, and uh, I've enjoyed being on the bank. To be fair, like I said, a bit frustrating not been able to catch the fish in your peg uh, due to the weather conditions but that's fishing so um, yeah next out um, I'm out on Wednesday uh, so two matches in a week which is quite good for me um, so we're gonna go Tunnel Barn uh, which will be much of the same as uh, today really so uh, looking forward to that one um, so yeah hopefully this uh, sort of first video blog wasn't too bad and um, you'll have a look at the next one. Alright, thank you.